welcome to our second location. So, Doris, where have you brought us? Can you share the viewers where we are? So, we are near uh, the marketplace. This is the old town. You can see this beautiful building over there, which is really old remains of the town. Like, this is German old tradition house building. And over there, um, there's the statue of Beethoven, uh, of Beethoven. And Bonn is known for Beethoven's birthplace. He was born here and grew up here for a few years. And yeah. Sounds good. All right. Enough talking. I know you guys don't want to hear me talk anymore. So <laughs> let's just roll that mall bureau and explore this mesmerizing place together. Let's go. I could get used to Are you ready for this, Doris? Oh, I'm so ready. All right. Oh, but I'm so bad at spinning. In three, two, one, we're gonna spin this wheel and see what restaurant we're gonna go and review. So, oh. let's go. Spicy, spicy, spicy. And what do you have? Oh, not spicy. Oh, look what we got. <laughs> we got Vietnamese. Wow, Vietnamese is really delicious. I can't wait to bring Doris to try some really authentic Vietnamese food. So. Keep your bellies hungry, folks. And I can't wait to show Doris some of this amazing food that we have here. Let's go. I'm excited. Hi, guys. Welcome back to our final restaurant of the day. Man, Doris, that, all the walking has definitely made me hungry. Oh, me has too. It? <laughs> nice. Um, we had to do some Googling, but we found a highly rated restaurant that is highly regarded for its authentic Vietnamese food. It, and it is right across from us. Um, I'm so excited to let Doris try some really authentic Vietnamese food. Doris, are you ready to try some? Oh, I'm so ready. Let's do it. Great. All right, guys, we've got our juice. We have lychee and we have guava. This is the first time Doris is trying lychee and she's also going to try guava as well and we'll get her thoughts on it. Okay, so let's give it a taste and share with the viewers how it tastes like. Very, very sweet. Sweet. It tastes very sweet. Mm. I've never tasted this fruit before. Also, very refreshing taste, I would say. Nice. The, the, the smell is not that sweet, but if you taste it, it's, it's more sweet. But it tastes a little bit like pineapple. We have another drink for Doris, and that's the guava juice. So let's let her give it a taste. And I'll show a picture of what guava is like. It looks very different. So the, the lychee one was more clear and this one looks like it's actually made out of fruit, like they grind it to food through a blender. So I'm gonna try this. Mmm, I like this one more. Yeah, nice. Because it smells more, it smells more like fruit. As soon as I lifted the glass, it just smelled. And the lychee one wasn't that strong. 
Mm, I like this one more. So how would you rate it out of 10? The lychee is for me like, well, five out of 10. I would, I would drink it if somebody gave it to me, but if I had the, the choice, maybe I would choose something else. And this one is more like an eight out of 10 because it's still a little bit too sweet for me, mm -hmm. but um, I would definitely drink this again. This looks like a spread. <laughs> so why don't we try the spring roll first, Doris? This is a very traditional Vietnamese appetizer. It's basically a rice paper being used as a wrap that it, and it's filled with shrimp and vermicelli, which is like white noodles, and then with uh, lettuce as well. And then we, did, we dip it in this uh, like sweet, salty, shrimpy sauce. That's so, so big. <laughs> yeah. Dip it and then give it a go and let me know how it tastes. Mm. It tastes very fresh. Mm. I think there's cucumber in there, isn't it? There's mint. I mean, there's mint yeah. inside, okay, that's why it tastes so fresh. Mm -hmm. that's, the smell comes up. Yeah. The sauce is also very delicious. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. This is our second dish. And let's give it a try, shall we? Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna try the beef first. I've got a big piece of beef here. So I'm gonna try this. Mm. The beef is really tender. Mm. Oh, there's something crunchy. That's fried shallots. Especially with the fried onions together. Like the beef is soft and the onion give it a tr crunchy texture. So it's very delicious together. All right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So this is the noodle soup. All right, guys, the moment we've all been waiting for, this is the star dish. Fur is like the staple food of Vietnam. Everybody eats it. It's beef noodle soup. The broth has been boiled for a really long time. And it's very tasty, so I can't wait to let Doris try. So give it a taste. Mm, I love the broth. The broth is so tasty. I really, really like this. The meat is really, really, really soft. These noodles are more my style. I like them a little bit thicker. This is a 10 out of 10 for me. I'm glad you like it a lot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, we'll finish up the food and come back with the final review. So we'll see you later. And I'm stuffed. Oh, I'm I so also full. So that was such a great meal. Doris, uh, what are your thoughts on the meal that we had? It was really delicious. I really liked it because the taste is fresher than German food. Like the food we had before, um, it's more heavy and salty than this one. And also the broth uh, of the pho. Mm -hmm. It was so clean, and, but still deep taste. So I really, really liked this. I appreciate it a lot. Yeah. Nice. See you in the next video. So peace. Bye.